Hey, what is up, Ben Jr. We're bringing a review of the Skull Candy Ink 2 earbuds. Now, these will run you around $20 to $25, depending on if you get the mic edition or not. I got these on sale at Journeys for $21, so pretty neat. And right off the bat, when I first listened to these, I was really disappointed. Almost as disappointed as when I first got the Low Riders. Those are a no-go. But these just sound... The bass is okay for your bass heavy listeners. They're really decent. But everything else is so out of control. It's like a bunch of noise just blaring into your eardrums and that's not okay. I mean, it just sounds awful. I wonder how these compare to say 5050s, which cost, you know, over two times more. But I was thinking, you know, speakers and all that, what could be the difference? But there is a big difference and the difference is the sound quality and just sounds awful i'm sorry school candy you disappointed me but this is a waste of like 20 dollars. i mean it really is they do go for 15 dollars at stores on sale sometimes without the mic edition but i just thought these sounded terrible i mean the wire's not even that great it just it's plastic everything you see is plastic so i don't see how that's gonna last you it is i I device compatible with its mic and its control, but I just don't like this earbuds. I mean, if you got some money on you and you want to buy some cheap earbuds, but have a little money left over, I don't know. I just wouldn't go with these exactly. I think the House of Marley's is a way better option, and it just costs ten dollars more. It's thirty dollars, but they surpass the sound of these completely i mean it's just these are okay earbuds i mean like if you just have 20 15 dollars and you want to get some skull candies okay i guess but even if that just work up to 10 bucks just to get the house of marley's or maybe the skull candy smoking butts i mean just not these i mean i don't know I don't like them. I have a good friend of mine. He's had them for a long time. He's had actually three pairs that I've noticed. He had red, blue, and then he went back to red. And then he told me that the speaker driver went out on him. And I was a little bit conscious. Uh, consci forget it. A little worried about getting these earbuds. But, you know, I decided to anyways because I have a terrible history with earbuds. I mean, oh, if you wanted to, like, end, of, end the video right now. They're terrible. Don't get them. No good. But going back into my story, I bought some school candy times for a good friend of mine. Went into Apple Store, lost them. Um, I have my Beats tours. They snagged. So one of the sides stopped working. I got my 5050s. They snagged. They stopped working. That was a heartbreaking moment. They are the best school candy earbuds I've ever had. It's just, they're amazing. The Titans that I had, they were stolen. So were the other Titans I just purchased, recently purchased for a friend. Um, And my House of Marley's, they, a friend of mine got them taken away from a teacher and then one side stopped working. So I had to resort to some pretty shitty earbuds. Then I bought these, it's a little bit of an upgrade, nothing much. Not as good, not as good as the i uh earpods there you go the earpods not as good as the earpods, but I just have a bad, bad history of earbuds if I'm not mistaken, I think these are the only ones that I have that are working besides the slayers because my skull candy stopped working I mean it's just bad I'm hopefully gonna get the mix masters, hopefully I can only try and save up but I'm also interested in getting the Monster, oh god, what is it called, Monster, I don't know, it's inspired after that old school band, but it comes with like 30 some gel tips, but I don't know, I think I'm just going to stop collecting earbuds altogether. If you haven't checked out my new longboard review, so that's my video of the Skull Candy Inked 2 um, they're just not really that worth it. I mean, oh 
So just kind of hold up of getting those. So that's my review. All right, I'm out.